Percy is swirling in Clay County over changes in leadership at a dozen of the district schools. News 4 Jax first told you about this with a push alert last month. The superintendent had installed new principals at various schools, and with that came a few terminations. This also affected administrators beyond principals, and unhappy parents at one school have started a petition. Channel 4 Scott Johnson joins us live in Clay County. Scott? So a lot of schools around the district will see some changes next year, but a lot of parents being very vocal critics of these staffing changes, including that one you mentioned, hundreds of signatures. A lot of parents talked to me saying they're not happy. Numerous changes announced at the end of the school year included a lot of new principals from Middleburg to Fleming Island, and the district confirmed fewer than five principals were let go. Other administrators got the axe too. Amy Tilton is a parent well aware of some of the outrage this caused. What did you heard? Um, about the quick change with everything, and a lot of parents aren't very happy with this situation. Really? What? Yeah, I mean, well, actually, a few of us have talked, and there's a mixed motion about what's going on. The outrage was quite prevalent in one Middleburg Elementary School, where a few hundred parents have signed a petition demanding a now let go principal be brought back. The petition calls her firing in extreme injustice. Justice. Please help us petition our school board in Addison Davis to make the changes needed to elevate Clay. But Tilton tells me she's not opposed to the changes. A lot more aren't liking it, but a lot more want change. We want to see the difference in the schools because, um, like for me, we've been out here since my daughter was in elementary and we're in high school now. For other parents, there has been confusion. I hadn't heard about it until I got an automated message introducing the new principal. Was it confusing at all? or? A little bit. Why Just because I wasn't aware. And after the news came out, uh, Superintendent Addison Davis released a statement who is wrapping up his first school year as superintendent of Clay County Schools. These individuals were handpicked and demonstrate the ability and skill set to improve teaching and learning, build a positive climate and culture, and help lead Clay County to become one of the top tier school districts in Florida. We're live in Clay County, Scott Johnson, Channel 4, the local station.